Hey folks, welcome back to Stranded Alien Dawn. Everyone's still asleep. Well, I guess Umair just woke up. But Edmund is off to work on our our uh, our new defense strategy here. But while I was editing, I kept noticing more and more of these motion sensors. We had the one here that I turned off. We had another one sitting over here I've forgotten all about. And the one we just moved. So I'll go ahead and utilize three of them to really spread out our uh, our sensor footprint. So I think that is probably the better way to do it. That's right, Umiar was set last time to get these traps, because I knew I'd forget. So, good planning. <laughs> All right, Paula is up cooking. Rita got back late. She was uh, bringing in the bug meat from this last bugs that she had cleaned up. Uh, Carter, you need to eat. Oh, 6 a.m. And your happiness is actually not forecast. I don't know. You're fully happy, but you're aiming for there. Probably just because of your hunger. Why don't you grab some relaxation time and then grab... Eh, you can eat pretty much anything because I think once these two bars are full, you're going to be great. So grab some dried meat. And then, we got to use that stuff up. <clears throat> and then, what was I thinking about you? Let's have you come on back out and butcher some more of these guys. So, actually it's the overgrowns. Overgrown. I've got to do you guys all individually, huh? Interesting. Overgrown. And do you. Okay. Actually, these are the newer ones. And then do five of those, and five of those, and another four of those, and sure, five of those. Okay, we'll get more fuel, um, pre-fuel, that's what we'll call them. So, how are we doing fuel-wise? This guy still has zero, so well, we're at plus 99 right now. Sun is up, the... Windmills are not doing that great, but still, plus 99. Windmills are only half powered. I guess it made quite a difference how we got everything online. Is there anything else not online that's helping us? I don't know. I mean, we turned off the one sensor, but that's that was piddly. Huh. Not sure. This is still happening, though. I don't actually see any, any razor and any, uh, what do we call it? It's here somewhere. Well, grain. Uh, grain grass. So, integrity, consuming, growth 29%. How come we don't actually see it? That's what I'm curious about. Um, this gives me the whole group, and that gives me the one. Harvest, cut, change crop. The whole group. Now it says grain grass, but I expected to see some evidence that there's something in there. Grain yield zero. Rita, where are you at right now? You were planting. When you're done, come in here and and let's see what options I have. Let's have you well cut grain grass. Strange. I expect to see little sprouts or something. I don't know what's up there. Um, Umiar is handling Shroom Torch. She's doing just regular stuff around the, the homestead. Uh, Carter is going to keep the, uh, the buzzards away. A couple of... Well, still got a little bit of meat on those guys. Otherwise, Edward... Edmund... Ed. Shooting a target. That's what I'm worried about. Okay. You, your relaxations. Let's let's go get rid of some things. Let's. Do you have? Um. You do not. Let's get you down here. Get some meat. Get something to eat, and then let's send you up there and destroy everything up there and be done with that that mining outpo. Okay. So grab something that you really enjoy, which I don't see any buttermelon pie anywhere. Normally they're stored here. What's that on the ground right there? There you are. Eat that. And then go ahead and let that run. What are you? 
Oh, okay. Then head over here and destroy is X. XU, XU. Uh, we'll leave that one. I don't think they will use these. We'll have to destroy you. And we'll have to destroy you. And then, I guess, have you bring back with you the last of the ore. Um, where was the old camp? Here? We have a table left and a little bit of ore there, too. Okay. So, Edmund, let's see. Nobody else is on a mission to destroy. Simon, what are you doing? You were assembling. Okay. And I'm back here again. <laughs> okay. Let's start the trip once more. Fire off. Go up there. There we are. Well. Uh, there we are. Wrong rocks. Okay. So, Edmund, when you are done, you are still eating. All right. Then you're going to come out and uh, deconstruct and deconstruct and deconstruct. Just the three? And then deconstruct four things. And then you're going to... I think over here might be better. Your silicone, your ore. Then you're going to haul ore. And I'll wait. I'll try to catch you. Hopefully you will gather them all. Otherwise I'm going to have to... Just like the uh, red meat last time. I'm going to have to micromanage you into actually picking them all up. <clears throat> Lead you by the hand. Carter is in great shape. He must have gone off to get something to eat because animal attack 16. More hamburger? More hamburgers coming in. Yep. Yeah. Well, I think boy, Edmund, did you get the job done? So close. Carter, quickly. Build this thing. Let's see how this works. And if they will not attack this fence because they did not get shot at. Although, where are they at? Right there. What's that noise? That's a bone crusher. Oh, there you are. Bone picker. Picker or crusher? Ugly. <laughs> okay, take this out before they get here. They're starting their slow motion rush right now. Yeah, they're on their way. Uh, you're done. Okay. Then, Carter, while you're at it, yeah, while you're at it, let's get, well, that one built, and then let's get these built. Missing resources. Why, what are you? We have no bricks. Okay. Well, in that case, let's get started over here. I'll send somebody else out to gather that, uh, that meat. So you pop over and start... Reconstruct door. Reconstruct. It's not letting me do five at a time. Really? I'm going to have to individually click every one of those. Arr. Okay. Carter, you're over there. It's Umiar. Handling a furnace. They're really on slow motion. They really are. Okay. You did that one. Let's have you go grab all this meat before the uh, for the buzzards get it. So haul all that for me. And so these now should not have a line of sight to anything on the ground, just in the air. I think that's a thing. Okay, they're still thinking about it. Oh, oh, yeah, we got excited. Okay, Umiar, did you make it out here? There you are. Scare these guys away. No, 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 no. No red buzzards. And there's still a few traps over here. Alright, you gonna get it all? You're doing a lot better job than Edmund did last night. Perfect. 
All right, so bug meat, we're back up to a thousand. Uh, damaged fence. Well, you look at that. They did not go around. And now we know. Okay. So it is not an automatic thing that they're going to aim for this. Some will take the path of least resistance. And they're going to go right through this one. Okay, Carter. Oh, you just got over there, didn't you? Oh, you're repairing. Okay. Um, Paulette, I need someone to stun real quick. Hop over. We're kind of going in right over here, aren't we? We really are. Okay, can you get up here? I don't know if you can or not. Draft. Can you go here? That's a little close, though. We have a porch out here. Where are we? Right there. Not really. Why don't you just go here? You can stun them from that right there. Okay. Rita, I guess same thing. Uh, you're doing what right now? You are transporting. Okay, so draft and hop out here, out, right out the door from where you're at. You are getting, so you're not doing anything right now. Draft, head over here. <clears throat> Edmund. Oh, you're busy. Okay. And Umiar, you are a little busy. Okay, you're doing what I already asked you to do, and I'm thankful. Let's see what these guys can do. Are the others going to go around? No, they are determined to bash right through this. Yeah, take them out. They're going to take out our stuffs. Oh, they are. Now they're going, what, against trees? Oh, I guess for something that big, trees would count as kind of a, uh, as kind of a barrier. Hmm. But the stun gun. Look at the stun gun. I tell you, that's helping out a lot. There goes the first tree. All right, take them out. Down and one more. And I guess a storm just ended or something. Destroyed structures. And one more shot. Down. Now where's the rest? There were like 16. Animals attacking. Oh, dudes. They split up. <laughs> okay. Um, you guys. One, two, three. Over to, I guess, the porch. And Carter, you are constructing a shelf. Carter, come on out here. Draft and get here as fast as they. And we'll all think long and hard about uh, this attack. Are you just, like, trampling my stuffs? I think you're going for the power poles. What are you guys doing? Yeah, so much damage could happen here until that first shot goes in. Uh, guys, do you really not have a, a shot here? Rita? Oh, you haven't arrived? No, you've arrived. Can you... You can't because of the hill. You're not high enough. Okay. Well, let's put you right out here at this edge, Rita. And we'll just wait for the, uh, the red to go away. Okay, what else we got? That's all done. No one walked around this side. Those are ours. And they're just coming into, into view now. Okay, so Paulette is right there. Yeah, the stoves are a problem. It's about as close as you get. Put you right there. Carter, you right next to her. That's it. Okay, first one in. Really, you guys don't... Oh, they're below the, the fence line. Look at that. So, do we need some kind of a high structure out here for situations like this? Build something right in here in place of the berries. I kind of think so. The fence out here, because it's not a, a three rail like these, we can't shoot through it. We can't even see them. Okay, since we haven't shot, where are you guys going? You're kind of heading out this way. Will you continue around till you find that spot? What are you going to do? Hmm. Slow motion. <laughs> I 
the attack that took three days. <laughs> We're down to 11. Oh, dude, really? Okay, so Rita, I need you to take him out. Whatever that means, take him out. Oh, they just got excited. Oh, they got shot at. Okay. Okay, well, these guys will keep them busy. Rita will take them out. More lighting problems. So, I think we're coming in and out of snowstorms. That's what changes the lighting. Fleeing danger, Umiar, is now drafted. And... Heading right over there. Rita is after this one. And one more shot. Yep, that's what it took. Rita, head up to... Right over there. Otherwise, you guys are breaking my things. But little by little, we're taking them out. Mostly by stun. There, you're down. All I can concentrate on stunning this group. These guys are a little anxious. Are you stuck in the trees? Really? I think you are. I think your horns are a little big. Yep. Are we done? One left. Right there. Uh, I don't know what... Are you trapped under? I don't know. All of you guys, let's... There's no attack. There. I don't know what just happened there. Cargo pod! Cargo pod. That is... That's up there, not out here. And RimWorld, that would be crashing down on our heads right now. Made a crash landing in the close vicinity. Okay, so let's remember that one. Alright, so taking out the last one. And we're done? We're done. So you guys are going to undraft. Edmund made it. Is he... he he's just transporting. He's... He's lost it. Okay. Edmund, let's deconstruct first. You guys are all going away, and I think I'm just going to let that happen. Let's work on repairing. Let's work on... Boy, how do you repair something that was supposed to be rebuilt? I don't know. It's going to be a little confused now. Hmm. Okay. Edmund, you may have to sleep here tonight. Which means this might have to wait till the morning. That could be a thing. Alright, well let's get these things destroyed. I'll have to micromanage you into bed and then after a little bit of, at least one of your things can be boosted. Um... You could instead get some relaxation cancel deconstruct shooting target and practice shooting all right let's get your relaxation bar up you are now part of the mining outpo yeah okay you gotta go that far away really all right simon everybody up here is just going to do their thing now yeah. Okay. You guys do as you need to. Handling, eating, getting, drinking. Edmund. <laughs> Getting his relaxation up. He was pretty tanked there. Gotta keep him happy enough to make it back tomorrow. Yeah. Carter reached seven. Combat. Two destroyed. Lightning rod destroyed. Okay. Cued research. Old equipment on somebody. Yeah, whatever it is, it's just a warning. No, oh, making a snowman. We haven't done that this year, have we? Yeah, sure. We'll sit back and have a snowman moment. Thinking about it. There it is.
Okay, well, he doesn't have any food on him. That's going to be a problem. He only got that? I guess it helped his happiness, not so much his relaxation. Okay. Well, Edmund, why don't you go get some sleep? <clears throat> I get a several pluses on that. Um, happiness. He's got... He came with quite a few, so that's really going to help. But the target practice and the snowman helped. Slept in a spacious bedroom last night. Three hours, that goes away. He enjoyed a beverage. Well, yesterday, that's going to go away. Ate a tasty meal. Well, two hours, that goes away. Yeah, so suddenly this is going to start decreasing pretty quickly. But we are adding the sleep in, which is what? Something about sleeping in a comfortable bed? Target eight. Many enjoyed. Oh, they're, yeah, they're going away quick. Maybe the bed happens after it's complete. Hungry is starting to kick in. So when you're done, you're going to deconstruct that one. You're going to... You... Do not repair. Deconstruct. Then you're going to do this. Then you're going to do this. <clears throat> and then you're going to... Are you or? You are. Where are you? There, you're at the end now. Then you're going to... We have to wait. Okay. I heard a noise. Something's walking around in the snow. Something's down here. Huh. There's a creepy critter out here. Oh, got these guys. Ah, he wandered into the wrong camp. <laughs> here goes the other one. I'm out of here. I'm out of here. <laughs> yeah. Scary chickens. All right, Edmund, you are basically done. You've got your orders. Can you do them, or are you going to just, you know, reset and sit there with a question mark? Nope, you're good. Everybody else is asleep, and we start in our next day soon. Be curious to see what happens when this flag goes away when he is logged into it. Change area, so no more areas, so there's nothing to change to. You're getting 10 to eat. What does that mean? Way over here. Um, I might be foolish to not let him. Yeah. You do that. And then... Come back and get these. Okay. Everybody else is still sleeping. Um, Carter, I think the first thing to do... Well, we don't have any bricks. That is a problem. I can't get you to repair. Unless I just send this immediately into carbon nanotubes. Let's think about that. Let's try going from here to here. At least that section. 20 fences. Cancel. Remove destroyed object. Cancel the removed. Whatever's left, convert it to this. Okay. So what did that do? We need to... I guess let's just build with carbon nanotubes. So, where is that? Defense. Defense. Fill these in with the right things. So we're not... Can I do two of them at a time? I can. Okay. So I filled in the two that had been destroyed. And we are now... Now we've got bricks available. Because these had been preloaded, but not the job wasn't done. Okay. So you are going to be... Carbon nanotubes. Carbon nanotubes. Okay. 
So do a stretch of the better fence right through here since that's already proven to be a problem. Now, Edmund, I'm on pause because I want to make sure that he doesn't, uh, oh, he doesn't do something foolish. <laughs> it's a long walk out here to do it all over again. Like, taking this home to eat it? Or are you going to eat it here? Dude. See, I don't know where he's going. I think he's going all the way home. Yeah. Because this isn't... Wait a minute, where am I? Mining out Poe. I've lost it. Okay, Edmund is here. The berries are... I'm really turned around. Where are those, yeah, the berries? Where are the rest of them that are on the ground? He walked, there they are, okay. That means over here. Where's the old mining outpo? And we've still got a structure sitting out here and wow, it's, uh, it's hard to find. Okay. Well, I need you to get the ore. There it is. Right there. And I can't get him to go here. To... Can I? I can't get him to eat. I can make him sit and relax. I can't make him bring the berries over to eat them. And we're tanking. So close. Yet so far. Yeah, trying to convince him without that flag. Without the ability to force it. Best I can do right now is I can't even tell him to haul because it means he's going to walk half the speed all the way home. Edmund can't do this. He just can't. It is a Simon thing. We've got to have the faster walk speed. Okay. So Edmund, you're going to draft and undraft. So you drop that. You picked it up. I need you to not pick it up. So I guess I'll have to draft you and just keep you drafted. So you actually run home. Home is here. Because by the time you get halfway there, you're going to be falling apart. Okay, draft and come here. Mm. Frustrating, he won't eat it while walking. So that is a problem. Something that is not well thought through with the game. Carter, when you get up, you need to immediately get this going again. And then I think your day is going to be spent on this area. Reconstruct. Ah, uh, sure. That will make you bring a whole bunch of carbon nanotubes over. And then you're going to construct these next. Okay. So, Omiar is sleeping. You're in pretty good shape. <clears throat> Play a musical instrument. And then get to butchering. Carter's busy doing that. And the other things. Paulette, meals. We're actually sitting pretty good on meals right now. Though with them frozen, they not, they're not going to go bad. I better keep using Paulette for, for all of her skills while she is here. Because she's the next one leaving. So cook some bread when you wake up. And cook some meat pie when you wake up. Okay, so Rita, when you get up, you can come over here. Well, you can grab something to eat. You're in good shape, so you can grab some dried meat. And then you can... 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. And 11, that's 16, yep. Yeah. You can butcher these five. So who is left? Simon is actually one or two ahead on electronics. When you finish this, you're going to find yourself a meat pie. We're turning this off for now. And Simon is going to go get... Well, we have the ore. But he actually better go get some more of these. Because we have a lot of fences to build. Uh, Simon... After that, you're going to haul that. So eat and transport. And Paulette, when you've cooked that one, you can come over. Actually, 
Well, we already have assignments. Okay, when you're done, handle that. Rita is going to eat and uh, go off to do the other butchering. Umiar has made it here already. Where is he at? He's he's playing the didgeridoo. Okay, Edmund, you are running in. And coming in on empty, too. You are starving. <clears throat> starving is probably like a negative 20-something. So far, we're ravenously for negative 18, but when we hit zero, I think that's going to go even higher. Food, there's a 4% left. Be curious to see what that hits. We don't starve very often here, so curious to see how that works. Who we are? Are you making lots of uh, butchering noises? <clears throat> Rita, what you doing? Boy, I tell you, when you tell them to eat, all the other orders just go away. Yeah, I, I don't get it. So Paulette is transporting... Oh, she, I see. She made oil out of that grain. Okay. Did you do the job transporting? Let's handle. Or they shift it further down their queue and add their own stuff in. Maybe that's what's really happening, but no, because it didn't say butcher on her on her list. It just said transport. Okay, so you're going to do that. Carter is repairing fence. But I asked you to repair these fences. <laughs> Carter will just put it back in the list, I guess. Reconstruct. Oh, he brought over the stuff and then collected all the bricks. Is that what's going on? Might be. Okay. So, Umiar, you need food soon. Yeah, you'll figure that out on your own, I hope. There have been times when they just starve themselves instead. Edmund made it in. Yep, he is at zero. His happiness, yep, negative 27. Okay, undo, and you will automatically grab something really good to eat. Okay. So you're fine there, then let's give you a musical instrument, something you haven't already done. So you did the shooting target, but you need these two things. A decoration and an instrument. That'll give you two more plus 18s, and that should fix you for the day. <clears throat> Then, you'll either take off and start doing these, or you will start repairing. I'm not sure how you're programmed right now. Rita is three-fifths done. Well, that's still cooking away. Cool. Carter is transporting a whole bunch of hay. Yeah, he's off his uh, programming as well. Okay, when you're done, come grab some dried meat, and then one more time. What was with these? Just bricks. We have plenty of bricks now. Okay, you can work on those. So, Umiar, you escaped, didn't you? Bring in the leather. How do we tell them leather is not important? How do we do that? If I say no more leather here or over there, then it's just going to spam me with messages. You have insufficient storage space. So drop that, come on out and haul the, the meats. And then go in and get some foods. So you need help. Umiar really liked bread so you can then head in and grab that and then we'll have you come back out and butcher and then butcher the last five so that'll be your day <clears throat> and Edmund where are you at you are transporting oh, the rest of the leather <laughs> Um, oh, there's some meat there. Let's leave that. Umiar can transport that. Let's have you, for one, let's finish building these. Just to be done with them. Do that now. And then, 
see if I can get you to do some of this work. So reconstruct, see, it only gets me to do one of them, though. I can't do the string of them. So I almost just have to let him do all of his things so there's nothing left but this. But I really like that done before the next major attack comes in. Rita, no. Rita, let's grab the meats. Okay. Then Rita will get onto something else. Ah, we finally have some grass showing up here. Consuming two. Hmm. Okay, it just took a long time to see it. So Umayar is off to do the other butchering. Okay. Edmund is butchering also. Well, if Edmund's determined to butcher, then let's have him do these instead. Do those four and that one. And... That not work? It did, but I thought you took over everything. So Umiar is going to do. I guess there's five in here. Okay. So he will handle that one. Do we have a baby yet? I don't think so. Not yet. Okay. So over here, where's a Carter? Carter is constructing a fence. Oh, he's getting these guys done. Edmund is butchering, Omar is butchering, Rita is helping to cook. She's helping to cook, great. And Paulette is as well, Simon went off to... Did you really just get 24? Oh, they used to do that to me in RimWorld too. Drove me nuts. If there was a space that needed 24 to fill it. They would just grab the 24 instead of grabbing the 124 and filling multiple spaces. All that trip. Because I didn't babysit them. And you only got 24. Unbelievable. And when they start doing that, sometimes you can't break it. You just gotta let them. I'll bring them all the way back there. He'll drop these 24 and pick up another 24. Just because... Because 24 is all he needed to fill in the blanks here. Mm. So hauling to construction project is not necessarily the best route to go. Because he could have hauled 240. But there weren't enough slots in this section for that, so he didn't. I think that's what's going on. Oh boy. That means he's going to do that every time. Hmm. Can't get him to bring the excess. Okay. <clears throat> well, looks like we have the rest of the winter and probably the spring to get these guys out of here because this is taking forever. Okay, batteries. Oh, we're coming. We're getting hit on batteries. Good. Hopefully, these guys won't need to run much anymore. Well, I guess nighttime. Otherwise, we're coming in at 36 out of 40 for windmills. That's good. Prince is outside. Which is fine, so long as we're, you know, not being attacked. Simon is determined. He's not going to transport any more of that, of that carbon nanotube stuff until he gets all the leather in. <laughs> yeah. As long as Olfen keep attacking us, there's going to be lots and lots of leather. Okay, you are butchering one more. Let's haul in the meats instead. Umayar can go butcher the last one. Alright, any more meats over here? we got 50 over there. So, Edmund, come get this one. He's got to be led. Okay, well, that's all the meats. <clears throat> i got to watch Umayar. He's going to bring the leather in instead. Carter is getting some work done. Alright. Oh, those butchering noises. Mm -mm. Alrighty. Haul in the meat. Perfect. Done here. 
Just leathers. I'm sure Simon will take care of that soon. But Carter's sticking to it this time. Okay. Nineteen hundred, so a storm must have ended. That was the lighting thing there. So now you're just gonna keep walking around in circles and putting them all in. Perfect. Okay. So Prince, you're just enjoying your freedom, aren't you? You are. <laughs> Oh, this is fun out here. Yeah. Simon is bench pressing. Edmund is transporting leather. Uh, Edmund, can you... Can you... Can you... Uh, reconstruct. Yeah, we'll, we'll divert you. Simon, whom we are, handling fermented barrels. Oh, oh, fermentation barrels. Good. Doing it on your own. Rita, transporting. And you are building a kit. I don't think I want any more of those kits. So we're mirrored. I think we are. So... That kit is a survival kit. Let's turn you off. Rita is now. Now, what is this? You're actually making survival meals. Oh. I think I'm going to say no to that. So survival meals I had set for like number six or seven, eight. Okay. Let's take you down to the bottom. I think that's probably not a thing now. We've we've done that. None of them in this one? Right. So Rita, what you doing now? So now you're making veggie soup. Okay. That works. Haven't been reconstructing Umiar is filling and transporting. Carter is relaxing. Playing an arcade game. There you are. Looks like Alien is attacking birds, is he? Uh, I don't know what that is. It's interesting. Alright, you're going to appreciate a shroom torch. You are petting an olfin. You are eating. You are... Handling fermentation barrels. Spaceship detected. Now, who is not cooking? Handling... Carter, you get to do the honors this time. Come on over here. I'll let you do it next, though. Contact spaceship. <clears throat> You're just about finished anyway. Woohoo! There he goes. Those shroom torches. Gotta love them. Edmund's grabbing something to eat. And another supply crate or is somebody going home? And speaking of supplies, when you're done with that, can you... Haul that away and haul that away. Clean up. Thank you. <clears throat> okay. Request clothing. Ah, oh, supplies. Okay. We're going to be till summer finishing this series. I can see it now. All righty. Passerby spaceship is patrol. It can't take any passengers on board. Sympathetic enough to offer some equipment. Synthetic armor. Winter clothes, summer clothes. We don't know, need any of them. There truly is no need. There isn't. I'm going... <sighs> yeah, we'll say no thanks. Really no point. Maybe that will speed up the timing to the next one by not accepting it. What if that's a thing? If you don't accept it, then immediately goes the timer gets going again instead of giving you a cooldown period of uh, um, you've already been helped recently hmm. worth a try batteries are doing good generators are not running it is 2300 and we are losing a lot 151 okay so it's a good thing we we actually uh, are getting positive amounts of power in the daytime to 
handle the losses at night. It's we're we're balancing this thing. Uh, traps two. I think I only see two. That didn't help. That have not been reset. So there might be there's one right in there. Three. So we're doing fine there. We'll let the buzzards clean up the uh, the last of the carcasses out here. Bug meat wise, we're doing pretty good, aren't we? Well, we're down to 900 because Umiar is doing his job. Fuel wise, <clears throat> we're into the 400s again. Good. Otherwise, one in the morning, and it sure doesn't look like it because of the. Uh, I guess the moonlight against the white snow. Hmm. But Simon's going to sleep. Omiar's getting something to eat, then he'll be going to sleep. Carter, too. Paulette and Edmund are already there, and Rita is there as well. So I think that kind of wraps up this exciting episode. <laughs> yeah, we'll get there. Anyway, it's been Noble Rambler. Thanks for watching, guys, and I'll catch you later. Bye bye.